the model was produced at the American GM plant in Doraville. Officially, cars were not sold and got into our country thanks to enterprising auto distillers. German differs from American relatives in a different design of bumpers, a proprietary radiator grille, and different interior and power units. The overseas origin of the car often causes problems with spare parts, and their cost is higher than for other Opel models. Thanks to high-quality paintwork and anti-corrosion coating even on those machines, which have been operated for a long time, there is no rust. Salon Salon Sintra is spacious and comfortable. Depending on the configuration, it can be 7-seater or 8-seater, respectively, with two separate armchairs or with a solid sofa in the trunk. In the second row of seats there is a lot of space both above the head and from the knees to the backs of the front seats, and the third is very comfortable. True, to get there, you need sports dexterity. In expensive versions, the front seats turn 180 degrees. Passenger seats of the second and third rows can be folded completely, put only their backs, move back or forward, or even removed from the car, turning it into a roomy cargo van. Noise isolation of the cabin is unimportant, the sound of a running engine is well audible. With the air conditioner, which is included in the basic equipment of the minivan, problems often arise, the ceiling cuffs dry out, and the Freon leaves the leaky air conditioning system, especially on first-year cars. Engine. More often on the market there are minivans equipped with a 2.2-liter gasoline engine. In it, over time, leaks of the rear crankshaft oil seal were noted. Every 60,000 kilometers, when replacing the timing belt, it is advisable to install a new pump, which is driven by the belt and has approximately the same service life as it. In the 3.0-liter Sintra engine of the first year of production, there were cases of leakage of an oil cooler embedded in the radiator of the cooling system. With this breakdown, oil can enter the engine cooling system. The radiator is not reparable, and you will have to buy a new part. Transmission The minivan is equipped with a 5-speed manual gearbox which was aggregated with 2.2-liter gasoline and turbo diesel engines, and a 4-speed automatic transmission designed for the 3.0-liter 6. Both units are reliable, and characteristic breakdowns during their operation have not been identified. Suspension The suspension of the minivan is characterized by high energy intensity and durability. More often on our roads, after 50 to 60,000 kilometers, you will have to change the bushings of the anti-roll bar. The silent blocks of the front levers and ball bearings have a long resource and are changed separately from the levers. But the wheel bearings of the front and rear wheels are made together with the hub and the ABS sensor and cost about $400. Steering. In all versions, rack and pinion steering is equipped with hydraulic booster, which is characterized by some impressiveness. However, this is forgivable for a family minivan. But there are more serious claims to the durability of this node. So, on our roads, a pair of gear rack breaks over time, and this malfunction is manifested by a knock when driving through bumps. In addition, on machines of the first years of production, the seals of the steering rack and power steering pump may lose their tightness. At the branded service station, these parts are not repaired, they must be replaced. Although domestic craftsmen can restore failed nodes. Brake System The braking system is very effective due to the use of disc mechanisms, in front, ventilated, and the ABS system. Brake pads are expensive. For example, branded front pads are about $100, and non-original pads are over $40. The functionality and comfort of Opel Sintra deserve all praise. However, the car owner will have to put up with the high cost of maintenance and parts, which, moreover, are often out of stock.